African Liberation Day, renamed Africa Day, is observed globally on May 25th. This date commemorates the founding of the Organization of African Unity, now known as the African Union, on the 25th of May, 1963. Its charter has sought to improve the living standards of the people of Africa across member states. It is celebrated not only on the African continent, but around the world, as the diaspora is considered the sixth region of the African Union. In recognition of Barbados' proud status as an integral part of global Africa, we continue to acknowledge the centrality of the 1816 Bussa Rebellion not only to our hard-won individual rights and freedoms, but to our shared history, heritage, and cultural identity. No, we know that you can't change the past. But history is another story. Sure. History is Ooh. the story of the past. Sure. But the body that write the story is Ooh. usually be the body that get the last sure. laugh. And the body that get left out the story Ooh. is usually be the body that sure. hold the last lash. So the Bus Rebellion Don't pop worry, off and the popcorns and the plantocracy was getting mashed. But after the rebellion was put down, burned and crashed, the African side of the story could have been lost to us in the winds of history like ash. Our story has historically been told poorly by those who saw us as property. But now that we can write our own names on history's pages in our own history books, we can include names, facts, angles that they would have overlooked. And even if we can't call all, we can include a good few of the names of the ancestors who were involved. Now, the story as told by the plantocracy points to Washington Franklin. But in the memory of the people, it wasn't him who led the rebellion of 1816. Our ancestors remembered Bassa as the leader of the rebel team. Washington Franklin wasn't even recorded as being on the battle scene. What does this controversy really mean? When Barbadians decided sure. to be free, no ifs, ands, buts, Ooh. nor in-betweens, was it sure. Bassa or Washington Franklin Ooh. at the head of them? Sure. What about Jackie, Mingo, William Ooh. Green, Prince William and the rest sure. of them? What about Nanny Grigg and the other revolutionary women? What if? Um. What if? What if history was not just the story of one or two great men? What if our history was the story of individuals coming together in unity to bring an end to an unjust system? What if our history was the story of whole communities? What if the war that we remember as General Bassas is a war that belongs to all of us? And we must not only rewrite the history of a bygone era. What if we are currently writing the history of the future? <laughs>